Our top news this week. In today's episode, we have a new firmware update for the Sony FX6 with a new look and exciting new features, a new beta release for the latest DaVinci Resolve 19 update, and new explainer videos going over the Sony Electronic Variable ND filter system. Sony FX6 users have been waiting for firmware version 5.0 since it was announced back in January, and now it's officially available to download. New features include a new preset called 709 Tone Bass Look and the ability to use a 1.5x D-Squeeze setting for both the viewfinder and HDMI output when using specific anamorphic lenses. The monitor and control app also gets new features such as waveform, false color and histogram displays. You can read the full release notes and download firmware version 5.0 via the link below. The latest Resolve 19 Public Beta 3 release brings improved speed performance for Ultra NR noise reduction and the ability to enable the music remixer for individual clips. This update also adds support for viewing content in HDR on the UI for Windows, as well as the ability to reset all layers at once on a note stack. Beta 3 also improves cursor refresh operation when editing, as well as overall replay functionality. Sony has released a fresh batch of tutorials about their popular electronic variable ND filter system. These videos offer a solid explanation of how this filter system works, and also a good overview of the practical benefits in the field, such as seamless exposure control when filming exteriors. I would highly recommend these to anyone who recently purchased an FX9, FX6 or a Sony Burano, or is considering a hire for the first time. And that's all the news we have for this week. We'll be back again next week with more news in 90 seconds.